I have here such single board converter from 12 volts to 230 volts AC at sinusoidal. Uh, it is a bit crazy because it can handle uh, the reactive power, but because of this it has very low power consumption when no load is applied from uh, the output. Because uh, this modulation here is uh, such a way that uh, it switches only two transistors at one diagonal for half of the period of sinusoidal wave and uh, with uh, the other period it uh, switches uh, the other two transistors only. So. Uh, when there is a zero voltage uh, output, uh, no transistor is switched on actually. At the, at the zero crossing point there is no transistor switched on. So because of this it can't uh, operate with the reactive power. It can deliver only uh, the active power. But because of this uh, the switching losses of the transistors are very low you know that uh, there is about uh, 360 volts AC, uh, DC on the uh, uh, behind the rectifier of the secondary uh, secondary side. So uh, this is the output waveform. There is a tube amplifier uh, connected to this, and there is about. Uh, it's a little bit more than 230, but doesn't matter. The shape is uh, such uh, because of there is a transformer, so there are capacitors uh, behind uh, the inductors to filter the, the current and they supply uh, the reactive power. When the load is disconnected, this is uh, the waveform on the output. There is over voltage because uh, uh, the amplitude is correct, but uh, the effective value is wrong. Because uh, actually the control uh, IC cannot uh, decrease uh, the amplitude. This is this is the amplifier connected again, so this is there is some reactive power consumed by the transformer, so it compensates a bit. There is more load connected, uh, actually a rectifier of the plate voltage uh, from the amplifier. But you can see that the voltage uh, remains stable, even we added uh, double the load. So I have a s solar iron connected to it, so I can switch it on to show what happens. And this is what happens. Actually, uh, the effective value uh, drops because uh, the, the soldering iron has uh, another transformer so it draws uh, a lot of inductive uh, inductive load and the converter cannot supply uh, the reactive power needed for uh, the connected transformer so i would have to add uh, more capacitors uh, to the output of the converter to supply uh, the re the needed reactive power for uh, the connected transformers. So it is a bit interesting because uh, classical con uh, converter don't have this treble actually. Uh, when the benefit is that there are uh, practically uh, no switching losses. The uh, transistors are called and I can even remove uh, this uh, this heatsink because uh, the uh, transistors are completely cool. Uh, the only thing that is heating a bit is a primary transformer because uh, it is uh, to fit uh, the winding uh, there is uh, only thin wire uh, for uh, the load.
There are drivers with uh, desaturation protection, so it can actually handle uh, the short circuit. There is uh, 9 amperes IGBTs connected to so we can uh, check uh, the the output short it should probably work so we are still running actually uh, the IC didn't turn off uh, the converter yeah, because uh, I have disconnected the probe so it is there again it doesn't uh, the IC doesn't turn off because there is no feedback from uh, the drivers but uh, the feedback actually is the voltage and it is designed such that when the voltage drops for more than four seconds it turns off it is uh, the Chinese TDS uh, 22685 uh, it is uh, SPVM modulator but actually it looks like uh, it is uh, MCU pre-programmed and sold uh, as a different uh, different type of IC hard to say it looks like uh, yeah, uh, in the data sheet of uh, the IC, uh, the input voltage So uh, it is labeled as power good. So it's, it is it, it is probably MCU because uh, it looks like they rewritten the uh, the type of the IC. When the voltage input voltage rise is too slow, it doesn't turn on because there is probably some uh, trouble in the. Uh, fine state machine of the software inside but when connecting to the batteries it's okay I usually don't use uh, this type of MCUs but uh, here uh, the the goal was to to make the converter as simple as possible and using the TH THT uh, parts